I want to show you a new feature in Visual Studio 2013 Update 3 that uh, works together with Internet Explorer. So you need to have like the latest Windows updates uh, for uh, because that adds a little feature to Internet Explorer to work with Visual Studio. And so here's what how it works. So I have uh, Internet Explorer on the right side of the screen and I have uh, Visual Studio on the left. Now I can go in here in Internet Explorer and inspect any element. So let's just inspect this header right here. Inspect element and it shows up here in the F12 tools. But notice that it also showed up in uh, Visual Studio. So Visual Studio opens the source that generated the DOM element I was inspecting in Internet Explorer. And uh, we can even do it here Let's do inspect the element, and we can see that it's just a link, but the source in Visual Studio is actually a C# -sharp construct uh, in M from MVC and Racer. So uh, we have the full source mapping going on here, and uh, and F12 just calls into Visual Studio as I select anything, and you know I can just navigate here. I can actually just use the keyboard. Uh, to move up and down in the F12 tools and you can see the Visual Studio just follows along and it just opens in the preview tab any of the pages that um, will match uh, whatever DOM element I'm uh, currently inspecting in the F12 tools. So I hope you're going to enjoy this. Uh, this was a fun feature to build and uh, I hope it's going to add a lot of value and make it easier for you to debug your application and figure out what's going on. Uh, between the server-side generation of HTML and the live living DOM in the uh, browser. Thanks for watching.